A sect is a subgroup of a religious, political, or philosophical belief system, usually an offshoot of a larger group. Although the term was originally a classification for religious separated groups, it can now refer to any organization that breaks away from a larger one to follow a different set of rules and principles. In an Indian context, sect refers to an organized tradition. Etymology <inaudible> 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 The word sect comes from the Latin noun secta a feminine form of a variant past participle of the verb sequi, to follow, meaning a way, road, and figuratively a prescribed way, mode, or manner, and hence metonymously, a discipline or school of thought as defined by a set of methods and doctrines. The present gamut of meanings of sect has been influenced by confusion with the homonymous but etymologically unrelated Latin word secta the feminine form of the past participle of the verb secare, to cut. <laughs> <laughs> Sociological definitions and descriptions There are several different sociological definitions and descriptions for the term. Among the first to define them were Max Weber and Ernst Trolch In the church sect typology they are described as newly formed religious groups that form to protest elements of their parent religion generally a denomination. Their motivation tends to be situated in accusations of apostasy or heresy in the parent denomination, they are often decrying liberal trends in denominational development and advocating a return to true religion. The American sociologists Rodney Stark and William Sims Bainbridge assert that Sects claim to be authentic purged, refurbished version of the faith from which they split. They further assert that sects have, in contrast to churches, a high degree of tension with the surrounding society. Other sociologists of religion such as Fred Niss have asserted that sectarianism is best described with regard to what a sect is in tension with. Some religious groups exist in tension only with co-religious groups of different ethnicities, or exist in tension with the whole of society rather than the church which the sect originated from. Sectarianism is sometimes defined in the sociology of religion as a worldview that emphasizes the unique legitimacy of believers' creed and practices and that heightens tension with the larger society by engaging in boundary-maintaining practices. The English sociology Sociologist Roy Wallace argues that a sect is characterized by epistemological authoritarianism. Sects possess some authoritative locus for the legitimate attribution of heresy. According to Wallace, sects lay a claim to possess unique and privileged access to the truth or salvation. And their committed adherents typically regard all those outside the confines of the collectivity as in error. He contrasts this with a cult that he described as characterized by epistemological individualism, by which he means that the cult has no clear locus of final authority beyond the individual member. Topic. In other languages The corresponding words for sect in European languages other than English, secta German, sect French, secta Spanish, Catalan, secta Romanian, seda Portuguese, Galician, secta Polish, Czech, Slovak, Bosnian, Croatian, Serbian, Slovenian, Latvian, Lithuanian, sect Danish, Estonian, Norwegian, Swedish, secta Dutch, secta Hungarian, secta Russian, Serbian, Bulgarian, secta Greek refer to a harmful religious sect and translate into English as cult. In France, since the 1970s, sect has a specific meaning which is very different from the English word. In Buddhism 
The Macmillan Encyclopedia of Religion distinguishes three types of classification of Buddhism, separated into movements, nikayas, and doctrinal schools. Schools Theravada, primarily in South Asia and Southeast Asia, Mahayana, primarily in East Asia. Vajrayana, primarily in Tibet, Bhutan, Nepal, India, Mongolia and the Russian Republic of Kalmykia. Nikayas, or monastic fraternities, three of which survive at the present day. Theravada, in Southeast Asia and South Asia. Dharmaguptaka, in China, Korea and Vietnam. Mulasarvastivada, in the Tibetan tradition. In Christianity While the historical usage of the term «sect» in Christendom has had pejorative connotations, referring to a group or movement with heretical beliefs or practices that deviate from those of groups considered orthodox, its primary meaning is to indicate a community which has separated itself in some way from the larger body from which its members came and to which they may or may not still adhere. The term remains valid for this purpose. Roman Catholic sects There are many groups outside the Roman Catholic Church which regard themselves as Catholic, such as the Community of the Lady of All Nations, the Palmarian Catholic Church, the Philippine Independent Church, the Brazilian Catholic Apostolic Church, the Movement for the Restoration of the Ten Commandments of God, Most Holy Family Monastery, and others. Protestant sects <inaudible> In Hinduism The Indologist Axel Michaels writes in his book about Hinduism that in an Indian context the word Sect does not denote a split or excluded community, but rather an organized tradition, usually established by founder with ascetic practices. According to Michaels, Indian sects do not focus on heresy, since the lack of a center or a compulsory center makes this impossible, instead, the focus is on adherents and followers. In Islam The ancient schools of fiqh or sharia in Islam are known as madhabs. In the beginning Islam was classically divided into three major sects. These political divisions are well known as Sunni Islam, Shia Islam and Kariji Islam. Each sect developed several distinct jurisprudence systems reflecting their own understanding of the Islamic law during the course of the history of Islam. For instance, Sunnis are separated into five sub-sects, namely, Hanafi, Maliki, Shafi'i, Hanbali and Zahiri. The Shia, on the other hand, first developed Qasinism, which in turn divided into three major groupings known as Fivers, Seveners and Twelvers. The Zaydis separated first. The non-Zaydis are initially called as Rafida groups. These Rafidis were later divided into two subgroups known as Imamiya and Batiniya. The Imami Shia later brought into existence Jafari jurisprudence. Akbarism, Usulism, and Shaykhism were all ensued as variations of Jafari fiqh while Alawites and Alevis who are not the strict followers of Jafarism are developed separately from the teachings of Ithnashari Imams. Batiniya groups, on the other hand, were divided into two sub-groups known as Seveners and Ismailis. Karmatians who did not follow the Fatimid Caliphate were branched from the Seveners. Those groups of Batiniya who followed the Fatimids are the ancestors of today's Ismailis. Druze was emerged as an offshoot of Ismailism at the beginning of the 11th century. 
Ismailism at the end of the 11th century split into two major branches known as Nazari Ismaili assassins of Alamut and Mastali Ismaili. As a result of the assassination of Fatimid Caliph al-Amir by Akamil law, Mustali was once more again divided into Hafizis and Tayyabi Ismailis Dawudis, Sulaymanis and Alavis. The Kawaray were initially divided into five major branches, Sufris, Azarika, Najdit, Ajarites and Abadis, the Hanafi, Maliki, Shafi'i and Hanbali Sunnis, the Twelver groups, the Ismaili groups, the Zaydis, the Abadis, and the Zahiris continue to exist. In addition, new sects like Ahmadiyya movement, Black Muslim movements, Quranists, Salafis, Wahhabis, and Zikris have been emerged independently. Topic. Amman message An Islamic convention held in Jordan in July 2005, which brought 200 Muslim scholars from over 50 countries together, announced the official recognition of eight schools of Islamic jurisprudence and the varying schools of Islamic theology. The eight recognized Islamic schools and branches are Sunni Hanafi Sunni Maliki Sunni Shafi'i Sunni Hanbali Shi'i Imami followers of the Jafari jurisprudence Shi'i Zaidi Kariji Abadi Sunni Zahiri Topic In Jainism See also Classifications of religious movements Cult religious practice New religious movement One true church Religious exclusivism